Stephenville Empire Tribune, Stephenville, Texas, Friday, August 1st, 1947. Indian scout who knew Frank Dalton now is living at Heiko. Brushy Bill Roberts, 80, of Heiko, old-time Indian scout, recently submitted the following account of some of the highlights of his life to the Empire Tribune for publication. Quote, Born the first day of 1867 at Buffalo Gap in Taylor County, Texas, as I was trained by the Cheyenne Indians for a roper and a rider. I became an expert roper and rider at the age of 16. In the spring of 1884, I joined up with the scout gang guarding the stage line on the Idaho Trail. I served three years with that group, and during that time, I was in four stage holdups. No money was lost in these holdups. I lost 10 horses during the three years, using them as breastworks. I joined the anti-horse thief gang in 1887 to break up the horse stealing in Texas. I was a scout for 10 years. During that time, I was wounded 26 times holding horses for breastworks. We had six train holdups, but saved three of them, and we had four bank holdups, but saved two of them. We lost 20 horses while on the horse thief trail. Was rider in big rodeos. Quote, In 1889, I rode at the Cheyenne, Wyoming, North Platte, Nebraska, Coal Creek, Idaho, Butte, Montana, and Pendleton, Oregon. I rode in skill in 1893. I made one trip to South America, staying 10 months. We rode 1,000 head of Bronco horses, then came back to the United States. During my riding days, I rode 3,000 head of Bronx. Quote, My grandfather's name was Ben Roberts. He fought in the Mexican War under Sam Houston in 1836. My father, Al Roberts, called Wild Bill, the Indian fighter, began to fight wild Indians in 1853. When the Civil War broke out, he joined Ross Brigade in 1861. He was with that outfit in 1863 when they captured Cynthia Ann Parker from the Indians. After the Civil War, he was a ranger under Ross. Started Wild West Show. Quote, I put up a Wild West Show in 1895. Buffalo Bill Cody was the first man to put up a Wild West Show. Pony Bill was the next man, and I was third. I was in that business for 25 years. I am the only man that started the Wild West show business now living. Frank Dalton of Gladewater has known me since 1869. DeWitt Travis of Longview and Jim Coplin of Tulsa, Oklahoma have known me for 60 years. These three men are still living and can verify the above statements.